it here, seeing some hot sets. Absolutely, we we just saw a fantastic hot set with Carflow taking it 2-1 over Dill, and we've got another one coming up with Joje versus Ling. Ling, a uh, CTPR player, I believe? Yes, he is, he's on the CTPR. Yep, and Joje as well, one of our fine Diddy Kong players here, taking things over both Kuga and Helper, so definitely, uh, Two, definitely two respectable wins. Helper, of course, oh, has been on the come up with that Sora. But we're going to see right now how Joje fares up against Ling. I already love the use of the uh, banana from Ling yep. to try and... Uh, yep, so I saw the shield right there, too. Mm -hmm. Great awareness. And the monkey flip, too. Yep, all right. And something I do want to point out is these are uh, both two item characters. So we're going to be seeing a lot, a lot of, of item turnips, play. A lot of banana. Oh, my God. Yeah, and we can already see Ling holding and just like that. that banana. Yep, using the banana to his own game. Talk about item play, hitting him with the immediate forward smash frying pants in the face. Yep, and using that fire frying pan to secure the kill as well. So Ling already up three stocks to JoJ's two. JoJ almost with an unfortunate SD as well as the pressure. You know, that's something that JoJ really has to be careful with in this particular matchup because Ling has access to those turnips. You're absolutely know, right. The... Having access to the turnips is one thing, but you know, Peach combo game itself is definitely a scary thing itself without the turnips. Mm -hmm. And as well, just the, the barrel jetpack is going to be on notice. You can see, already see another item play right there. You know, you saw the Z drop banana in there, right? Mm -hmm. That's one dead. Yeah, you can already you can already see JoJ is trying to uh, trying to get those high recoveries. Doesn't want to rely on the barrels too much. But Ling already having conditioned that is ready with the uh, ready with the follow ups. And you're absolutely right. Ling still on his first knock too, making good use of it, getting in that damage. Unfortunate whiff of the F smash from JoJ means Ling is going to be living just a little bit longer. 118 right now, not quite able to Again, find the down smash into up smash. Kind of going for another up smash there, couldn't get it. Link just racking up damage. Mm -hmm. Yep, oh. 93 and another banana yep, confirmed. Banana. It feels like Link's using the banana more than John Jane right there, getting the side B. Yep, side B to catch JoJ's landing, and that is that is a three stock. That is definitely a, that is a good, confirmed, strong three stock right there. Yeah, definitely a. <laughs> Definitely a, a statement there being made by Ling. Of course, of course. Right there again. Using 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 the frying pan banana right there and hitting it into with the frying pan. Perfect. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so I think I I definitely Oh my god. Uh, yep, right there. Like, yep, the Z that's why I said the Z drop immediately in there. What's Ling, the kill? Ling got all three stocks. If you count uh the third stock being started from an interaction with the banana, Ling got all three stocks from Joe. Just Jason. banana. It's it's literally just banana. And he was able to close out that game and take it. Now we're going to F D. Counter so, Ooh, with the targets music. I so do. yeah, if I'm JoJ right now, I am I'm thinking, you know, I gotta be a little bit more mindful on when I have the banana out on stage and really just trying to make sure that Ling does not get to run away with it as much. And you can already see JoJ kind of try uh, with a little bit more quick movement on the banana as yep, well. Compared to the first game, you know, it's kind of slowing it down a bit. You know, that's what I wanted to see. You know, know when to commit, when not to commit. That being said, though, Ling with Banana in hand, and that is because JoJ threw it while uh, Ling was trying to let or edge guard him. Yep. Right now, JoJ at the ledge, staying from this ledge trapping from Ling. You know, besides Banana, you gotta admit, Turnip's also playing a role, but that backer's playing a huger role right there. Yeah, JoJ finally having been forced to commit to the barrel jetpack, and just like I was saying in game one, not quite working out to his favor. You already saw Ling tried to use that back air to pick up the banana. I guarantee it. I agree. Because he knows just how much he has been getting out of the banana in this match. Just like we saw the first game, making good use of the banana. Kind of a hopeful up smash swinging from Jay, trying to catch the float. And instead, now you're taking a peach combo for your troubles. Yep. Got the jump. All right. Big damage right there from Ling. Still on the first stock again. Mm hmm. See, almost, I really like the spacing from Ling, just barely, unfortunately, not able to get the turnip uh, perfectly at the ledge. But Ooh, finally, but no, JoJ yep, on the board. Finally taking the first stock with that back here. 
Maya just monkey flipping uh, across the entire stage. Uh, no real movement mix-ups there from Jojay. Uh, no need to, but 38% just from that. Ooh. And again, just getting a little bit too greedy with that banana. Ling is ready to catch it using that neutral air and get an opening. Oh, Ooh. getting hit by the banana this time. No punish, though. But I'm liking the way Jojay's playing this a little better compared to the first game. Sure, he's still a little overcommitting a bit. But he's starting to learn a little by little. Yeah, we're definitely starting to see the adaptation coming out from Jojay. Really trying to slow down that tempo, not hold forward as much, and uh, yeah, it's it is definitely starting to work out in his favor. What oh, I like great the parry. Yeah, I like the parry. Unfortunately, not able to capitalize on it, and unfortunately, not able to capitalize on the banana either. Link's still living with the second stock within the grab. Okay, just trading down tilts on shield. Just, just kind of poking, seeing, hello, do you want to play the neutral? Both, both trying to play it back and forth right now. But he has to be careful, he's on his last stock. Yeah, very. But I do love the patient play from Jojay as he slowly made his way back into center stage there. Obviously, Peach is such a difficult character to take space oh, on. But there the we turn. go. And uh, the coverage is just there. Yeah, even even though Ling didn't have to, just floating out there, forcing Jojay to recover with kind of an awkward uh, an awkward curve at the bottom, that just kind of spelled it for him. I agree, 100. percent You know, he had the covers there too in case. He Try to make it back. He was prepared. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, great stuff from Ling uh, with a three stock followed by a two stock, sending Joje down into the loser's side of bracket. Something I'd like to also point out is that if she's out over here, like, look where the camera is. Yeah, like, how do, you, how do you drive? <laughs> how do you drive? drive like, you're not making it over there. Yeah, you're literally driving blind. Wait, what? Mom? John? Yeah. John? John, John is numbers? out. Yeah. John, John numbers, numbers out. Out by Make Make taking things two one. Yeah. Dude, let's go Make Make. What an upset indeed.